fantastic diaper bag backpack. And I didn't quite get it before the baby was born, but I just got it about three weeks ago, and so I've been using it all of this time. I'm excited to talk to you guys about the new all-in-one leather backpack from Love 41. This backpack can be used as just like a regular backpack or a diaper bag. It has lots of pockets in it. Diaper bags were definitely thought of in the making of this bag, and I am just really excited to share it with you guys and show it to you. It is made of great leather. It's made of full grain leather. It will last probably, hopefully, years and years and years. So this review actually I feel like goes along really well with the motherhood side of this channel. My goal is to be about motherhood and about homeschool days because that's where I'm at right now and I want to share with you guys as fellow moms, fellow parents, just like what it's like. So I hope that this video brings value to you. I hope that you like the bag. I do want to show you guys what I have in it and how I'm setting it up further along in this video. So if you're wondering about timestamps, definitely check down below in the description and you will find the timestamps linked for that. So my channel is all about motherhood and homeschool days. I probably already said it before, but my name is Jackie and I have four boys, seven, five, two and a really little five week old named Zion. If you would like to follow along with my channel, definitely subscribe below. Drop a comment and let me know you're here. I would love to say hey. Now hold on a second. So I said that this backpack is made by Love 41. What's Love 41? So Love 41 is actually a company that was started about 10 years ago by Suzette Munson and Tina Litch helps run it. And what they do is they create products now. They do leather bags, mainly leather bags or leather items and they take all of the proceeds from those items, 100% of the proceeds, they give it back to orphans, widows, and street kids in Rwanda. So the Love 41 motto is changing lives together with leather. They just have done such an amazing job of really truly changing lives. So if you are into supporting businesses that give their proceeds to people in need and that is their one of their main goals in, a, in their business, definitely check out Love 41. I will obviously link them below, but I just wanted to talk to you guys a little bit about what they do. Um, I'll also link to their like films page and you guys can go just watch their videos about just things that they've done in the past to give back to people in need. Really awesome company. I am really excited to be sharing this product with you. So I'm not new to Love 41. I actually have an in. My aunt owns the company and my mother-in-law runs it with her. I'm a little biased, but it's an awesome company and they really do make wonderful full grain, full grain leather products that are going to last literally a lifetime. So I've had a few Love 41 bags. I've had a lot of Love 41 bags. Um, this is one that I have been waiting for. I think they started talking about making a diaper bag back when I had my first son, Eli, seven years ago. And so I have been waiting for this diaper bag and I'm really excited it's here with Zion so that I can use it and really with all my kids so as I said I've been using this bag for about three weeks now I am I'm really loving it I'm gonna talk to you guys about some of my favorite things about it and some of the things that are not my favorite things about it but for the most part overall I really really love this bag it is um, just it's gonna last me a really long time the cool thing is is I can use it not just for babies and snacks <laughs> like snacks because it's gonna have like a ton of snacks in it it can also be used like post babies and post needing to carry snacks um it's just a great great bag so the color that i have here is actually called tobacco and this is one of my favorite colors that they have tobacco is a really awesome color it's very very soft but it also patina as well which means that it wears well that it is going to look better over time it's probably going to get a little bit darker but it just picks up every scratch and mark so i can scratch it right there and it can just like add to the look of the bag they also offer i think three other colors in this bag but this was my favorite i felt like it went with what i wear more often better that is one reason why i chose this color tobacco so the first thing that i really like about this bag is the just simple look that it has up front it doesn't look you don't see a huge logo anywhere they do have their logo on it but it's not like in your face logo. It's just very simple. There's a pocket here. It has some natural leather right here, natural colored uh, full grain leather right here that just is gonna patina well on the zipper. It just look, looks really nice. But at the same time, it not only looks simple and nice, kind of like I like to have things, it also is functional. So you do have this front pocket and you have two side pockets. 
these two side pockets are they go from the top all the way down to the bottom which i really love that they're very deep that way i can put my phone down in it and not have to worry about my phone falling out or anything um and i could always also fit my wallet i mean here's a pacifier i actually need to wash this i think i don't know where it's been i really love that just the depth that this whole bag goes the depth is really awesome nice and deep and big you can fit a lot in there um, it is also really a wide bag. It has a lot of space. Like you can fit so much in this bag, which is wonderful if you have small children like I do. I will be lugging this out on hikes. I will be lugging it out every single day that we do something with four kids. And so I need it to be big. I need it to be spacious. I need to be able to fit extra clothes and diapers and snacks and all of the things in it. I love the size of it. It's very big. Yes, I can't jump on that little bag trend right now, those little backpacks. Although I do really love them, but I just can't do it because that is not where my life is at right now. I need a very large bag. This is a very large bag. So I'm going to just zip it open for you guys and kind of show you what's in there. So the first thing that when you unzip it is it opens up really wide. So I still have my unorganized bag in here. But you see that it opens just really nice and wide so that you can really get in. You can clean it out easily. And also one reason why you can clean it out easily is because it is pigskin lined. Pigskin is actually like really smooth and you can just like wipe it off. It has just a really soft texture to it, but it's also really easy to clean. So for example, my current backpack or the backpack that I was using before it had cloth in the inside which I never liked that because it's not like I could take out the cloth and put it in the washer because it was sewn in so literally like every spill that happened in that bag and I know there was spills that happened in that bag and every like little crumb and just yes just so gross like cloth at the bottom of the bag so I'm so glad that this backpack has this pigskin lining because you can just wipe it off when it gets dirty or if you need it to dry out it's going to dry out better you know than a cloth bag would and I can truly get a towel in there and dry it well also if you flip the bag around to the back of it it has a very large pocket in the back it is a nice safe spot for you know any sort of laptop or iPad or whatever you want in this back pocket. Um, it is also partially pigskin lined um, and the other side is just the suede part, back part of the leather. So um, nice and soft for any device that you have. So there's, like I said, it looks simple. It looks beautiful on the outside. There's not much to it on the outside other than gorgeous leather. Um, but it also has like all of these awesome pockets. It has one, two, three, four pockets on the outside. You need a lot of pockets when you're a mom. So as we head on into the inside of this bag, um, I just wanted to point out that there is this little key hook right here. I know like me losing my keys at the bottom of my bag and then me like feeling like panicking because I'm like, I don't have my keys. I can't find them because they're literally buried at the bottom of my bag. I'm probably the only one who does that. This little hook is great for keys if you remember to put it on there. Now, I've used it all of one time, but it is great that it's there. So the inside of this bag is nice and spacious. It is deep, it's nice and wide. Like I said, the opening is very wide. Um, it has two large pockets. Now, if you are a bottle feeding mama or dad, um, these pockets are great for bottles, extra bottles, just extra stuff. So I have personally been keeping my wallet and my phone in the front pocket but um, you can always keep your wallet, your phone, in these bigger pockets down here. Um, I usually store extra clothes in these pockets for my kiddos, just a pacifier, whatever. There's one large pocket that goes all the way to the bottom and um, it's on the inside. So this would be great for, you know, if you wanna keep, uh, you know, maybe a notebook or uh, something that is, you know, needs to be protected a little more, maybe a device of some sort, but it is a very large pocket also. Um, and then going just to the main opening, once again, there's just a very large area to just put diapers or whatever you need to put in there. Maybe you're not a parent and you're watching this to just get a look at this. I keep referring to diapers, but I'm using it as a diaper bag. So, you know, use your imagination for whatever else you wanna put in there. So it has a total of eight pockets, like eight large 
pockets. This is really wonderful if you have a lot of things that you need to compartmentalize. Yes, I love all the pockets in this. It just makes it really easy, really functional to use. Um, because I do have a lot of things that I want to put in different spots so it doesn't all fall to the bottom of the bag. So as for the, the back of this bag, um, it the straps are adjustable. Um, I have mine on the top, top strap here or the top hole right here on the buckle, um, but you can, you know, make it longer. One of the cool things about this bag is that it can really be used for guys and girls really easily. So my husband, you know, he's gonna be wearing it too because he's obviously a parent also of small children. So so these straps are actually a little bit padded here. Um, the only thing that I would say is I wish these straps went a little bit tighter on the back. So one thing that is really important to me right now in this stage of motherhood is if a backpack really works with baby wearing because um, I don't even have a stroller actually. I just baby wear right now. And um, so I am baby wearing most of the time when I'm out, when I'm going to be having my backpack on, I am going to be baby wearing. So it's really important that it fits well. So we went to the park last week and we got some shots of me baby wearing Zion with the backpack on. Now I will say I did wear it with my Solly baby wrap and the Solly baby wrap is just really good for just when you're just kind of, you know, just hanging out, walking around. But if you really want to like go on a long walk, be really comfortable and stuff, wearing my Lily baby carrier with the backpack worked so much better. I think any backpack with the Solly baby wrap just isn't very comfortable because the Solly baby wrap fits on your shoulders. But my Lily Baby Carrier, which is the one that I will be using for probably the next couple of years, fit really wonderful with this backpack so you can kind of see the way it looks with it on and it just, it fits really great. It looks really cool. So yeah, if you are a baby wearing parent, this backpack will work good for that. So I always have an extra blanket on hand and I like to keep that at the bottom of the bag if it's really well there. And then I also bring along my Solly baby wrap. I generally have my Lily baby wrap, baby carrier too, but the Lily baby fits really well in there. I have a cloth diaper and a few regular diapers that I carry along with me. And then some pull-ups for my older two-year-old. Then I have a changing mat from Love 41. It's coming, but it's not out yet. And everything fits really nicely down in there, tucked away. I also have a wet bag that I like to keep in the front pocket. And then I always carry an extra onesie or extra clothes for the baby just in case of a blowout, you know, mom life. And I also have a small pack of wipes that I keep with me and my favorite Yeti. And a few snacks for the boys to have on hand just in case they need something. And everything fits really well down in there and it's not even full yet. My wallet I keep in the front pocket. It's just easily accessible there and it fits really well. I keep a pen also just in case. As for my phone, I like to keep it in the side pockets because it fits really well, but it tucks deep enough to where I don't have to worry about it falling out. So that is a look at my packed bag. It is pretty minimal for having four kiddos, but I like it that way and it fits great in there. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope that you found this like super helpful in deciding if you are going to end up getting the universal backpack from Love 41. It is a really great backpack. I am really thankful to have it and I will be using it so much obviously. And so I hope that this was helpful. Definitely give me a thumbs up if you found this valuable and this helpful and drop a comment below. Let me know if you have a backpack that you already love or if you're looking for a backpack that it will be great for momming it or parenthood or beyond that. I would love to hear. Once again, don't forget to subscribe and thank you for being here and I hope you have a great day.